What is it like to stutter? Here are two real life examples. One, you're sitting at home playing video games with your friends. You put on your headset, the game begins. Everyone's talking and you can't speak. You can't say the word, you know the words that you wanna say, but you just can't get them out. You hit the mute button. All of a sudden, you can say those words. You can say any word. You're speaking fluently. You unmute yourself and you're stuck again. Somehow, the mute button is controlling your stutter. A second example, you're at a restaurant. You wanna order the burger with fries. The server walks up, asks you what you want, and you can't say it. You're stuck. You point at the menu, the server says, oh, you'd like the burger with fries. Suddenly, you can say it. Yes, I would like the burger with fries. These are two real life examples of situational stuttering. Now, some people will stutter in most every situation. Other people only in their highly stressed or when they feel anxious in those situations that they will stutter. Stuttering is in our conscious and our subconscious minds. It controls our speech. Our life experiences result in brain wiring for situational stuttering. Unfortunately, speech therapists are not trained about brain neuroplasticity and cannot help you rewire your brain for fluent speech. They typically will teach you how to modify your stutter, voluntarily stutter, or just accept your stutter for the rest of your life. Neuroplasticians, like myself, can teach you how to rewire your brain to speak fluently in every situation. I stuttered severely for 45 years and now teach people all over the world how to stop stuttering. Brain neuroplasticity is a real science and it works. If you know a person who stutters or the parent of a person who stutters, please share this video. Check out my bio, learn more about brain neuroplasticity and follow me. Let's go.